trust in God's providence enabled Mother Theodore to leave her homeland, sail halfway around the world, and found a new religious congregation. Born in France, Anne Therese Guerin was homeschooled by her mother. Her father was an officer in the French Navy. When Anne Therese was 10 years old, she knew she wanted to be a nun. When she was 15, her father was killed by bandits on his way home. Anne Therese was shattered. After that, she took charge of the house and cared for her sickly mother and younger sister. She entered the Sisters of Providence in 1823, taking the name Sister Theodore. An illness during novitiate left her with lifelong fragile health, but that did not keep her from becoming an accomplished teacher. She received a Medal of Honor for Excellence in Teaching. She also studied medicine in order to care for people who could not afford a doctor. At the invitation of a bishop in Indiana, USA, Sister Theodore and five sisters were sent in 1840. She was to establish a mother house and novitiate. Only later did she learn that her French superiors had already decided the sisters in the U.S. should form a new religious congregation under her leadership. Pioneering life is very hard. The sisters struggle to survive the first winter in a drafty little farmhouse. It was very cold, they were very poor, and food was scarce. They worked hard at learning English. By the following summer, they welcomed their first student. Within a year, they opened three schools. Other young women saw the good work they were doing and joined them. Mother Theodore and her community persevered despite fires, crop failures, prejudice against Catholic women religious, misunderstandings, and separation from their original religious congregation. She once told her sisters, have confidence in the providence that so far has never failed us. The way is not yet clear. Grope along slowly. Do not press matters. Be patient. Be trustful. Sixteen years after founding the community that was thriving in its spirituality and ministry, Mother Theodore died. She was beatified in 1998 and canonized as Saint Theodora Guerin eight years later.